pretty good, Peter. Only pretty good? Oh, I mean very good. You haven't changed your mind, have you? Of course not. Fine voice. Somewhat untrained, but clear as a bell. Have you been practicing? Well, a little. A lot. I see. Suppose we try that again. Da -di, da -da -di, da -da. No, <laughs> that's the way to do it, Peter. Yeah, a little more practice, and you might even win first prize at the song festival. Oh, Carlo, do you really mean that? Heidi, he's only joking. But you do have a fine voice, Peter. Hasn't he, Carlo? A very fine voice. Here is a package for uh, a Heidi of the Earth, please. Well, that's for me! <laughs> it better be. It's all the address there is. <laughs> Can you beat that? Heidi of Dorfli and a god you're just the same. I bet I know what it is. Gift from Clara. A gift? How come? Because it's my birthday. And you didn't remember, did you? Second year in a row you forgot. Happy birthday. Happy birthday! Happy birthday, Heidi. Did you make a wish? Can I open the packages now? Aren't you going to cut the cake first? Well... All right. All right, if you don't want to wait. Oh, thanks, Mama. One mitt for last year, one mitt for this year, from Peter. Then you didn't forget, and you were just making fun of me. Like them? They cost me three and a... Open Clara's. Here from Ernst. He dropped it by this morning with his best wishes. Strange, aren't they? What do you mean? Well, the way they look at you. Like they were trying to talk or something. Maybe they are. But you'll have to ask Ernst about that. Only a great artist like him could make them so at 